Hi, y'all. Jamie Graham, recruiter at Atlas Med Staff, coming from my beautiful home office upstairs. It's unfinished, so just ignore that. Uh, normally, I'm talking to you guys about workouts. Uh, Wednesday is Women's National Health and Fitness Day. So today we're going to talk a little bit more about the health portion, the food and that kind of stuff and touch a little bit on the workouts as well. The number one thing that people would always ask me when I was a trainer nutritionist is how do I lose weight? How do I get a skinny waist? Um, all of those things come back to the kitchen. So it's what you put in your body. I'm just gonna give you some tips and advice of different things that you can try. So I have five kids, which means that we have lots of snack foods like this. There are 140 calories in two tiny cookies. Two of these, 140 calories. That's a lot. Stay away from these. You can smell them. Okay, a banana has 105. Great source of carbs. I like to eat most of my fruit in the morning. That's just me. I feel like there's a lot of sugar in it and it's good sugar. Um, so I do a lot of smoothies. I've been doing um, cold coffee. So there's a brand called Stoke. Um, you can use that and it has protein in it. And then you can do your frozen banana or your frozen strawberry and that's it. And you blend it all up and it's delicious. Um, another good snack that I love are these tuna creations, okay? This one, ranch, 15 grams of protein, 70 calories. I like to mix mine with cottage cheese. Don't knock it until you try it, it's delicious. Um, another good snack that I think, I mean, I make this a lot for my kids because they like it. Apple, peanut butter, measure out your peanut butter, put it on a plate. Uh, another thing that I like, and I'm not trying to promote them or anything like that. It's just what I've, I've always used and it helps curb my appetite. So if we are going, 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 and we have, if you have work 12 hour shifts, three 12 hour shifts, and then, you know, you're going out or doing whatever. Snacking is the, one of the hardest things. So if I'm feeling snacky, I like this stuff. It's called the merge. It's from max muscle. It's delicious. It, it helps curb my appetite so that I'm not craving all those snacky foods. And I just mix it in water. And that's what I normally have when I'm at my desk around like one o'clock. All right, fitness stuff. So I got to put on my, my trainer hat. Um, as far as fitness goes, I've been on a running kick. So we have market to market coming up here in Nebraska. So I'm running, but when I run, I always, always incorporate lunges and or pushups. We live on gravel, so push-ups are a little bit challenging, but I still get them in. Um, anytime that you are doing something, especially women, I like to incorporate lunges. You want a nice booty? You gotta do the lunges and the squats. So this is for all you girls out there. Push-ups are your best friend. We're gonna get rid of this bra fat right here that none of us like, okay? And the lunges are gonna work our butt. As far as having a nice tiny waist and a flat stomach, that's all gonna come from your nutrition. If you guys have any other questions, you can find me, Atlas Med Staff, Jamie Graham, recruiter from, uh, well, I'm from Alvo, Nebraska, but we're based out of Omaha. So small town girl here. And uh, yeah, I hope you guys have a great Women's Health and Fitness Day. Get out there, get sweaty, get gross, eat a good meal with lots of protein and good carbs. Um, and then, you know, a little glass of wine isn't gonna hurt anybody either. Have a great day, y'all.